Ladies, gentlemen, and those in between, get ready for a fucking journey. <laughs> the tale tonight will be of heroes, villains, and of those in between. The forces of good and bad, fantasy and horror, vanilla and kinky will be tested in tonight's story. Our first adventure for the evening is the ever-changing magic man, <sighs> Sir Mordecai Thunkord III from the fallen kingdom of Peabody. <laughs> Hi, my name is Mordecai. Some call me a warlock, and some call me a soldier. But you can call me tonight. Oh, yes, Daddy, I do. <laughs> Anyways, our next spindler for the evening is the ex-elf prince, bad boy, from the kingdom of Azak. Azak! <laughs> okay. <laughs> Alistair Malice. So my royal pain in the ass parents, when I told them I wanted to be a musician instead of a king, they tried to like write me out of their will and kick me out of the kingdom, so I just took care of them. <laughs> okay. Anyways, our last slash buckler on this great expedition is Patricia. <laughs> the vegan druid Instagram influencer from the Quinoa Forest. <laughs> Hey guys, I'm really excited to get the opportunity to connect with the lands and align my chakras in this transport. Okay, enough with that. Let's save that for later. Um, our story begins tonight with our ragtag team and an enchantress. <laughs> Enchantress? Why, yes, it is me, the Enchantress. I will be sending you brave soldiers on a journey to get all that your heart desires that I can give you. But first, you must give me what I desire. We got a deal? Why the fuck else would we be here? <laughs> Great! All you have to do is cross the river of regrets. Go through the enchanted forest of tea, and then straight through the chambers of eternal screams, then make a left down the corridor, and there you shall find a dragon. Kill the beast, take out its heart, and bring it to me. We got a deal? Deal! Four way handshake? <laughs> and they were off. <laughs> After a few days of traveling, our troop had arrived at the Troll Bridge in the River of Regrets. So, like, would you rather be, like, pre-middle-aged Mariah Carey, or All I Want for Christmas is You, Mariah Carey? Easy! Fantasy era, Mariah. Thank you, next. <laughs> I don't know, recently I've been leaning more towards, the, you know, like, the, the Michael Myers Mariah Carey. <laughs> oh, definitely Christmas Queen Mariah. So, you know, if you happen to be an orientation, what would you be? You know, a top or a bottom? I can't decide. I guess you could say that I go both ways. <laughs> mm, guys, I have a bad feeling about this place. My vagina chakras are tingling. God <laughs> damn, damn Patricia, Patricia, do you, you ever shut the, the fuck up? <laughs> Oi! I'm the troll from down under. You cannot cross if you plunder. To cross my bridge, one must share a regret, the deepest and darkest they dare not forget. So, who will it be, my chickadees? I volunteer! Ah, uh, no, I want her. Hey, what's your biggest regret, sweetie? Me? No, I have no regrets. Oh, come on, Queen Quinoa. Just get it over with. What do you do, drink a glass of whole milk, buy one of Jeffree Star's makeup palettes, forget to vote in the election? Much. <laughs> Much worse. Damn. What did you do, girl? I... Uh, I lied about my fur, my faux fur coat. Mm. It's real fur. Mm. No, even worse, I, I hunted and skinned the poor creature. Oh, I'm so tired of living this druid lifestyle of peace, love, and earth. I wanted to feel something. 
I felt really regretful afterwards, but it felt so good. <laughs> Patricia! <laughs> Damn, this bitch is wild, but <laughs> you guys pass. Uh, on to the next adventure and come back to the River of Regret soon. Bye! <laughs> Beware! Ooh, that's mysterious. I love that. I saw the same sign outside of Bella Thorne's house. <laughs> um, maybe we shouldn't go here. The trees are whispering to me that it's something dangerous. Uh, uh, Patricia, just a quick question. Can you, like, get more vanilla? Because I... <laughs> Guys! This is the force of tea! We have to go in! Oh, hell yeah! But first, anyone up for a game of 21 questions? Ooh, okay. Fuck, Mary kill, um, Chris Hemsworth, Chris Evans, Christopher Walken, go. Easy. Fuck Walkins, Mary Evans, kill Hemsworth. What about you? Fuck, Mary kill. Me, Patricia, or the DM? Well, <laughs> fuck the dungeon master, obviously. Then marry you, you sly dark elf you. And then finally, cut Patricia's head off. <laughs> That's good, because I'd kill you all. Every single last one of you. I'll love the tea. Let's go. Oh. <laughs> Ooh. Does anyone else feel a little gassy, or is that just the cold, hard truth stirring in my loins? <laughs> Wait, guys, this is the forest of tea. Oh, my good friend Kim K told me all about this. Um, I, I think you meant fit tea. Mm, surprise, you dumbasses made it this far. Anyways, this is the enchanted forest of tea. Honest tea. There's only one way to get to the other side, and that is to be rid, to fill. I need one of you. Oh, say no more! I volunteer! I've been waiting to do this for months. All right, the library is open, okay? Which one of you? Eeny, meeny, miny, Patricia. Okay. <laughs> Listen up, you kale sucking, tree hugging, hot yoga, Trader Joe's shopping, lunatic prick bitch. Okay? You always preach about, like, health and everything, but, like, what about hygiene? Have you taken a shower? Because every time you get into Downward Dog, I can smell your quinoa coochie. <laughs> why you're laughing because your last two brain cells are finding it out like Nikki and Cardi. Also, you tapped me on Grinder like three hours ago. Being down low doesn't count if you forget to crop your face out of your picture. <laughs> mm, the tea is scorching hot and all, but my dear Alistair Malice, former prince of the Dark Elf Kingdom turned street performer juggalo, it is not your duty to rid others to fill, but to be read yourself. Next time you want to come at my man crush Monday's neck, did you think I was done because I know that you've been toying with, with us this entire time? Like, how come every time he gets to do something, it turns out well just because you're pulling the strings, you know, you ain't slick? I know you're just spoon-feeding him because you want to ride his disco stick. <laughs> okay, and we all know the real reason I'm here, so can we cut to the chase, capiche? <laughs> well, you didn't have to go that far, but whatever, fine. You pass the tea party trial, just go ahead. <laughs> Finally, our trope of adventures have arrived at the dragon's den. This is where they will encounter the biggest, baddest dragon in the game, Guy Fiery. <laughs> A word on the street is that Guy Fiery obliterated the former kingdom of Flav Orc Town. <laughs> but to get to the beast, the trope must pass my trail and trial of tortures in the Chamber of Secrets. Let's see what happens. Mm, through the pains, fires, and blood-stained walls, I weirdly feel at peace. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, so how do we kill this thing? Well, we all got our own powers, remember? Then why haven't we used them yet? <laughs> I mean, I can use four spells. And I've been in 11 wars in my lifetime, and I have not died yet, so. Well, I use my charm and talents to confuse my enemies by telling them facts of the Billboard Hot 100. <laughs> I can conjure up natural materials and meticulate organic matter whenever I wish. Hi, we're talking about real and useful powers here, Patricia. <laughs> my bad, I can make a mean acai bowl. Oh, Oh, visitors, you must want to 
to see the dragon. <laughs> and to get to the dragon, you must each pass my trial of tortures, while I will take each and every one of you individually. college kids at two in the morning. <laughs> well, I can't wait to fuck with them next week and see what happens on next week's episode of Dungeons, Dragons, and Dives. <laughs>